Hello and welcome to another episode. Now, this is just a quick update on the August 2024 maps and infotainment and features that have cropped up from users around the world that I've spotted. And the first one I've noticed is on the split screen for chargers. You've now got like a great or equal to sign on some of the symbols for the uh, chargers. It's a bit weird looking to be fair, but it is one change. If anybody can make sense of that or has made sense of it. And the other change I'd already seen, but I didn't know how to get to it. So um, Ionic Guy did a video um, last weekend on, on the US changes to the maps and infotainment. And, and basically he showed me how to do it. So I, I'm, I'll show you how to do it. So if you press nav and I'll do my previous, previous uh, John Groats destination. Now I'll start the guidance. The route guidance will start now. In a quarter mile, turn left at the end of the road. Basically, if you press where the flag is and Kia or Hyundai, um, it gives you an overview of the route along with the state of charge and the charges. So if I press that now, there it is. And it gives you the destination state of charge. So that saves you having to go into the other state of charge overview screen, which um, isn't completely clear so that is probably I think that's an improvement the other improvement I've found uh, but only in the US version at the moment but if anybody has this in the EU let me know and that is um, if I go to radio you've got all these uh, Meridian sound modes if you've got a Meridian amp so if you surround and custom and authentic um, in one of the previous updates, they took away the menu where you could change that for Android Auto and CarPlay. And on this image, I'll show you, put it on screen, which I found on Reddit. You can now change this in one of the menus again. But if you go to, into it on mine, it's not there. So if you go setup, sound, scroll down to connected device. And the image on the screen is for CarPlay. And as you'll notice at the very top, next to the magnifying glass, oh, I don't know why that's come up, um, you've now got the authentic and surround and custom sound modes has been put back on. Um, but it's not on CarPlay or mine, and it's not on Android Auto or mine either. Uh, others have reported it's back on Android Auto as well. Um, even if I plug my Android Auto in, it doesn't suddenly appear. So I don't think it's in the EU version, but if you have seen it in the EU version, please let me know. Anyway, those are the three changes I've spotted. Um, if anybody else has found anything else new that I've not seen in my previous episodes, please let me know. Thank you for watching.